Hi there, I am V. Welcome to my channel. I post daily videos, deck reviews, readings, live streams. I also collaborate with other beautiful tarot channels who I love to watch. So if you're interested in any of that, please subscribe and check out my playlists. They're all organized. All my videos are organized. I have like a whole series for everything. So um, today's it, today's uh, video is a basically, uh, I'm going to try to make these awesome daily readings bite-sized, um, easy to digest so that when you click on my video every single day, the reading is not so overwhelming or not so like full of so much information where you're feeling like, darn, I have to take notes or it's just in one ear, out the other. So I'm gonna to try to make these as uh, simple as I can. K-I-S-S, -S, keep it short and simple, keep it short and sweet. So uh, hopefully you like this style. I'm trying something new, trying to work out the kinks to see what works for everybody. So today is just a, I'm gonna just do an intuitive reading, see what cards wanna come out. And if any of them, if any of the messages resonate for you, please chime in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. So yeah, subscribe if you're new and let's go. I'm gonna shuffle. I'm gonna be using my Everyday Witch Oracle. See what wants to come out. And I look, I modified the sides. I love it now, now it pops. Now the yellow pops, everything's popping. Awesome. I do have a um, deck review for that. And I'm using my blended deck, my combo deck, this is the Halloween Oracle mixed in with the Divination of the Ancients Oracle. They were like the same size, same glossy vibe, and I think the same creators, so I thought I would combine them too to make them a nice, powerful deck. So, and the messages, they kind of resemble each other, which is so crazy. I'm like, what? What in the world? I guess because they're from the same creators and the publishing company. So let me uh, just shuffle and see what we need to talk about. So thank you for being here. All right, I am done. So we have two, three cards here. So the first card we have here is Healing Waters. So Healing Waters, this to me, this is like someone needing to cleanse badly. You need to get rid and detox from things that are not raising your vibrations and make, making you thrive. You know, if something is depriving you from thriving, don't deprive the thrive. No, <laughs> um, I would say get rid of it. So you know, cleansing. This is not. This can be about you taking a good, clean shower with crystals and salts and all that good stuff. But I would say this is more of a spiritual cleansing or a physical. More like um, get, getting rid of things that are either stunting your growth, distracting you, and maybe you're losing your focus. Maybe you're losing your control or something. So you gotta cleanse your energy your space and also if you're connecting with those people who are draining your energy like those energy vampires where you feel like you have you don't you don't like you don't have control over what you're saying or doing anymore because you have all these opinions flowing in your brain in your ear so this to me would be to say to you to take stock of what is helping you succeed in life what is helping you get to your goals right if you have people in your life who are discouraging you and stressing you out, then maybe that's you, need, you needing to, you know, cleanse the, the friendship circle or your family, whatever. You know, I'm not saying, oh, stop talking to them. I'm just saying, uh, protect your energy, protect your energy. You know, if, you're, if you know you, every time you get together with a certain family member and every time you leave them, you feel depleted, you feel depressed, you feel stressed out and anxious, then maybe there's a, a balance that you're needing. Maybe you need to set boundaries too. Maybe you can just spend like maybe an hour with them. Maybe you can just text them. 
from time to time or maybe you can just visit them uh, less frequently you know stuff like that I'm not saying to cut people out I'm just saying to take stock and be aware of what's happening what's what you need to detox in your life with this cleansing look at him he's taking a nice clean cleansing bath because He's feeling like he's needing some healing. And this can also be that maybe you're needing healing in your life. Maybe you're needing to uh, really slow down and, and focus on what what's aiding you, what's what's ailing you, whatever the case is. Um, if you're feeling, uh, this can also be a health thing. If you're feeling like you, you're, you can't get a head start in your health, you're always being pushed back. You get healthy and then you get sick again. You get healthy, this can, this can be maybe you need to take stock of what is making you feel so sick like get to the bottom of it don't just take medications to solve the problem get to the root of the cause what is what is what is it that it's causing you this health issue this problem so that's what this means for me let me know what it means for you we all have our own intuition and i would suggest going with that because uh, my intuition tells me this but you you might feel like you might say, oh, wait, this means something completely different for me. So then you go with that, you know? This is, like I said, general reading. Oh, I didn't say that, but this is a general reading. I can't grab everybody's energy. So if this means some, specifically something else for you, then go with that. And what do you think your advice would be? I would challenge you to step into your power and always try to figure things out with anybody's readings. Whatever readings you come across, you know, step outside of it and... and, and Step outside of what they're saying and really try to make it fit for you or try to understand what is happening here. And there's a reason why it came out and why you need to see this video, you know? So that's what I have for you as far as this cleansing card. And then we have fragmented. So this can be that you're maybe you're feeling like all out of sorts, out of whack. Uh, the sham, uh, what's it called? Discombobulated. Um, and you need to pick up your pieces and come together. Maybe that's why we need, we need a cleansing. Maybe you're feeling all over the place or you're feeling like you're not, you're not a full puzzle. You need to put your, yourself back together. Maybe you're feeling out of control or all scatterbrained or you know, out of whack with your life. You know, maybe nothing is uh, um, together like it should be. And so I would say with this, um, there's, a, there's, there's something waiting for you, something, something of importance waiting for you and we're only gonna get here figure this out figure out what your destiny is what your fate is what your purpose is if you get through this stage right here this awakening picking up the pieces healing bringing yourself together again there's something waiting for you it's in the stars I know it's cliche but that's what I'm getting that's what my intuition is sensing so thank you for watching hopefully this bite-sized uh, pick a card or not pick a card but uh, daily reading helped you somewhat and if it did or didn't, let me know either way in the comments. And you have a beautiful day. Come back tomorrow. Please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm V. Bye-bye.